Hello Ride On People. So the ride this weekend is to Fort Mountain to a place called uh, uh, Kohutta Overlook. We've been there before, we're going to have a picnic. Uh, it's a great, great place. It's pretty high elevation up on Fort Mountain and uh, the view extends kind of 70, 70, 80 miles there and it's all beautiful forests and uh, just a great ride. We, we're going to do some amazing roads tomorrow actually. Henderson Mountain, Fort Mountain, uh, 60, J Bridge, all sorts of uh, all sorts of good stuff. I'll probably put the camera on and do a bit of on-bike footage at some point. And also going to catch up with uh, Darcy who's just uh, traded a plethora of bikes for a new BMW R1250 in rally spec and um, he has an XR and uh, the GS in rally now and uh, it'd be good to get his early um, initial thoughts on the, on the bike after picking it up last uh, weekend and there'll probably be about, uh, about 10 of us actually tomorrow I think I can't even remember who is uh, up for the ride I think we have Jerry uh, and Eric on their V4s and Steve on his V4 uh, we may have Paul, we have Darcy, we have Jeannie, we have um, we have Scott on his XR. Uh, so there's, uh, there's quite a few of us and the forecast is absolutely perfect. It's a bit like it is now if you can tell through uh, the car windows. It's, it's kind of mid 70s, blue sky, sunshine and um, low humidity it's like autumn suddenly arrived this week and I couldn't be happier I think we've all had enough of the heat and a bit of humidity lately and we've also had a bit of rain lately so looking forward to getting out in the sunshine and enjoying the gorgeous roads catching up with my homies and uh, maybe doing a bit of on bike vlogging as well uh, so uh, stay with us and you'll see how we get on So Darcy, congratulations on your brand new R1250 GS in rally spec and colours. So tell me, uh, tell me what the bike is and its spec and why you went for it. This is a 2021 uh, 1250 GS rally. Um, the 2021s is slightly different on the colour. The 2020s were blue. The, the 21s are, are white over here. It has this kind of a silverish sticker so slightly different in rally package you get a lot of the gs bits wheels um foot pegs so i used to have a gs adventure decided to go with a gs and this one has a lot of those pieces on there so um i'm liking it i'm loving it it's a lighter bike uh, it's more nimble and a lot more fun on the curves um and i think Based on that, it'll be a fun off-road too. When I, the little off-road that I do. So, and did um, you did you trade any bikes for it on here? I traded a GS Adventure 2015 that I had, and actually a GS Adventure 2017 that my wife had. Um, we're trying to consolidate bikes, so we went from two to one, and uh, I am not um, regretting at all. Loving it. So. And currently, you have two bikes right i have a 21 uh, s 1000 xr and this one so that's what we decided to do is go down to two bikes the xr okay. and the gs and you, so your wife's doing that as well she's my she's wife already is doing the, GS, the same thing she? yep. and she's going to go for the xr mm -hmm. uh, next year so the um 
So I guess the premise is when you want to go fast and do the twisty stuff, you'll generally take the XR. And when you want to go on a trip and you want comfort or practicality or a long ride, maybe the GS. Absolutely, that, that. that's 100% the reason, so yeah. And so far so good, really loving it. Absolutely, about 190 miles, so breaking mileage still. Yeah, and we'll do about 250 today, so that'll be a nice little run nice for Nice run, absolutely. Perfect weather for it. And, uh, Having owned two GSs myself and two GSAs, I absolutely know where you're coming from with this and why you've gone for it. And uh, I like the colour scheme, I think that looks great. Uh, like you say, this sort of silver fleck is beautiful. This, is, this has that new option with the lights. I don't know if you can catch it on the camera, but it's kind of cool if you turn it on. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. So I haven't tested at night yet, but this is supposed to be the one that turns on. Very cool, very cool. Well, congratulations on the new bike. Thank and, you. And uh, get it run in, get some more miles on it, and we'll do a further update at a later date. Absolutely. And you, if you want to become one of the right on people, don't forget to subscribe. Ride often, ride carefully, ride on.